Okay. So many of you have been having problems with your uh, websites and uh, trying to link them together. So I'm going to show you how to do this. Uh, this is using uh, my website that I'm doing, which is a non-profit one. And so uh, we're going to go down here and, uh, and open up Dreamweaver. And now we have it set up. And I'm just going to go to my index.html. Okay. So I like using the split mode. I like using the code and then having the seeing how it looks like. So this is mine so far right now. Uh, my teacher, uh, he actually likes it and uh, he recommended, recommended me using uh, actually slices that we use in the Photoshop class instead of uh, using uh, CSS. Okay, so let me show you how to... Okay, so uh, when we first started, I don't know if you guys, uh, you had something that looked like this. This is like the nav bar right here. And when we click on it, I like using just use a split mode so you can see your code. I like using that first. Okay. So right here to the very left, if we highlight this right here, this is a list, and it'll it'll uh, highlight these. So this is uh, your navigation. So when you click on home, it has to go to home, about us, to the about us page. So right here on the first one it's index.html so that's my home page so I named it home so all of this should be uh, already there but when you first uh, start it used to be this Let me see. It used to have like a number thing right here and I think it was this was blank or it said link one or something like that so it looked like that let me see let me refresh it so it just said link one, right? So between right here, this is where you name it. Name it. Name it home. Okay. And right here, this is um, this code right here. This will take it. This is kind of like a map to it. To this page, to the home page. So you always have to be index.html. You always have to name it. and then the about us page and then all this right here and if you want to add another page to it you just I usually use the copy and paste just copy this code right here just copy and then like go to the very end just right here and then just paste it oh. sorry uh... yeah well let me show you. Copy and then paste it. So this is going to be a new page, right? If I want to add a new page and I name it, uh, for example, directions. Okay, so it's going to be named directions. And then if I have a page already set up, an HTML page over here with all that stuff, all the information on it. I just put directions, for example, dot HTML, and that will redirect it to that page and how it look like and stuff like that. So it's pretty, it's pretty simple. Um, since we already have the CSS already, you know, you can mess with it in the design area, you make it look however you want it. Which is one of the iLabs, I think, where you can, you know, hover over it and it'll change colors and stuff like that. Uh, so let, me, let me show you another page how it looks like. This is the About Us page, or the About page. So it looks about the same. It has all this stuff on it already. See right here. And that's how it links between each page. Right here. You see, they look the same thing. So they both have to be the same thing for each page to work within itself. So, no. Let me just show you how it looks like in the when it actually works. So this is it right here. This is the CSS, uh, a file, and I have three pages, images for my three pages. So I just go to index. This is where I should start. 
Okay, so it's opening it up. Okay, so that's my page right here. That's my website. And I already did the rollover things, so it'll change color when I roll over. When I go to the about us, as all this. And then uh, the recent iLab for in week three was add a new uh, a new page. So this was it right here. And I just did the lorem ipsum thing right here. And we also had to do a hyperlink and change it so when we roll over it, it'll change color or it'll underline it. So that's it right here. So each page is linked to each other. And before Dreamweaver, I used to do this right here. It might be different in different uh, browsers. And this one, it's view page source. It might be something else. So, so I'll have this. This is actually the uh, HTML code right here. So we see um, it knows it's a uh, CSS right here that uses a CSS style sheet right here, and then th these are the the navigation it links to each other. So you will know right here, they'll say uh, sidebar. This will be the sidebar right here, and then nav. That means it's a navigation bar sidebar. So see right there. Actually, pretty simple how to do it. So, if this helps, you know, uh, if not, you can uh, send me a message and I can help you out.